Hi all, and um, today what I want to do is I want to show you how we can set up the billing on an Azure DevOps organization. This is my organization, my personal organization. If we open it up, and you can see I haven't opened up in any particular project, I've just opened it up at the organizational level. If we go to the organizational settings at this point, we can see that um, it's set up. Um, on the overview tab, it's running in the East US 2 region and some other bits of information there. If I go to the billing section and then open this up, I can see that I'm currently set to use the free tier um, and I've not actually got any billing account set up. Yeah, um, So I'm just using the standard free tier for this Azure DevOps organization. I come up to the billing, P billing button and I click the setup billing. It goes and queries um, Azure to find out which organizations that I have available. And we can see here that I've got um, a main pay as you go one, and that's the one I want to use today. And then I can click save. Now, uh, if I was to choose to increase the number of parallel jobs, or the self-hosted agents, or the number of basic users, that would be billed through my um, pay, main pay-as-you-go uh, subscription. Thank you very much.